Hey everybody, East Coast Reefer here. Today I'm going to take you through the differences between the AI Prime 13, which is the old Prime with the 13 LEDs, and the Reef LED 90 from Red Sea. I tried to find a comparison between these two on YouTube and couldn't find anything at all, so I thought I'd make something for you. So I have here a power meter, it's the, the Senai Reef. I've got that running at the moment. I've got a screen capture on, so I'll share with you the results from that. Let me switch it to light mode. There we go. So, what I'll do is I'll take a series of measurements underneath the prime light at different points. We'll look at the, the wavelength and the intensity of the light, and then I'll do the same thing but with the Red Sea light. So here we are, just with the Prime running now. They're both set at the same height. Um, I've tried to match the colour between the two as best I can. Um, the Prime, or well, neither of them are, are actually maxed out in the settings either. Um, so I'll, I'll also go through and, and screen capture from my phone what the settings are. But let's go through with the power meter here. And right at the surface of the water, underneath the light we are 200 par and then let's do about 150 mil down we're at 100 let's do about 300 mil down we're at 70 and then go right down to the sand bed We are at 40 par. And then if we go back to kind of roughly the midpoint, directly under the LED, we're at 70 par. And then if we start to move to the middle here, down to 30. And then let's, let's lift up a little bit and go over, hit these frags here. We're at 21 there towards the back at about the same height we're at 60 and then at the front here we're at 30 so what I will do now is I'll just rest this over here and I'll switch off the prime and I'll switch on the red sea light and then I'll do the same tests again. There we go. So, <clears throat> using the uh, Red Sea light now, I'm going to focus. Um, I will do the same settings um, and just to give you an idea, we're at 65% blue, 35% white for this test. If we go just under the surface, right in the middle, we're at 500 par. And then coming down to 150 mil, we're at 250. If we go down to about 300 mil, we're at 110. And then right down at the sand bed, we're at 100, about 100, 120. Interestingly, it's not much different from up here. No, it's reading a little bit higher there, I must have had it in the wrong place. So 170 there. And then if we move out to the sides, we're here, we're at 80 and towards the front 170, 180 over to the side here. And we're at 260. And then I can miss all my SPS. There we go, let's get that in there. At the back, we're at 150. So, quite a bit of difference in the light intensity, which is what I noticed when I, I bought what, just one of these to start with. Um, fitted it to the tank and the difference between the two was, was huge. 
Um, the colour was a little bit more blue than I was used to with the Prime um, and the setup of the Prime, the flexibility of how much intensity on each colour is, is like infinitely more than with the Red Sea. Uh, with the Red Sea you get three colour choices, blue, white and moon. Um, but what I quite like with the Red Sea is it takes some of the f complexity out. It might reduce your flexibility, but it certainly takes the complexity out. And as you know, you know I'm fairly new to reefing. I'm not, I've not got a degree in uh, lightology. <laughs> Just made that word up there. I don't know if you can tell. Um, so for me, that the Red Sea is actually a, a much simpler light to use. There's no questions whether I'm getting it right or wrong. I know that if I set them up, I can just vary the intensity to, 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 to suit. Um, what I will probably do is I now have a second um, Red Sea 90 to fit on this side, um, but I wanted to record this video for you guys about the differences because like I say, I couldn't find anything that would tell you what the differences were between those two lights. So hopefully this has been helpful. If it has, please leave a like and consider subscribing. Thank you for watching to the end. Uh, you've listened to me for quite a while now. Um, I'll try and put a video like this, maybe not as in-depth as this one. Um, I'll try and put one out every week, normally on a Sunday, and normally it's 6 p.m. Um, if I'm feeling extra adventurous and I've made lots of videos I will probably then put one out on a Wednesday uh, and from there if I'm yeah if I'm feeling a little bit crazy I might put out a few more I've just started to do a my week in reefing um, quite like that watching the prestige reef dorks show um, so I've, I've started recording that and that's coming out on Monday night so I don't know if I'll keep doing that um, but this last week's been a really busy week, so I had lots to talk about. Um, but I'll try, try and keep doing that as well. So again, thank you for listening to all this extra waffle. Um, and hopefully I'll see you in another video really soon.